you're watching Mr. Tony of the Dead, who is very much alive, so go figure. Enjoy! Hey everybody, what's going on? Mr. Tony of the Dead here, and I have another movie review for everybody out there. This one's on the movie called The Beast. This is from Arrow Films USA. This was put out in 1975 and uh, obviously re-released now by Arrow on Blu-ray. And uh, this is another, I'm going to say the name wrong probably, but uh, Valerian Bar Barozix. Uh, that might be right, I'm not sure. But uh, this is a, apparently a most a very controversial film and uh, it like wildly reimagines Beauty and the Beast. Like like not <laughs> it's wildly it's no Disney movie um, but uh, basically it's about this uh, French aristocrat and he's attempting to um, to save the, this mansion like in the beginning they show him like cleaning the mansion and everything that's very dusty and cobwebs and everything and uh, he's going to be marrying off his um, his son who they say is deformed and he's kind of like uh, the son is um, what's his name Mathurin if I say that right he's he kind of like raises horses like on a on one of those uh, a stud stud farm I believe they're called <laughs> with the you know with the horses and having sex and all that stuff and uh, if I'm saying that name right I'm not sure if that's the kind of farm it is but um, he's kind of like into it a little too much you know uh, you could tell there's like the shot of his eyes where he's watching the horses and uh, you could tell he's really enjoying his job and uh, but he's supposed to be uh, he's not um, baptized or anything so his uncle which is the brother of the cardinal of you know of the church uh, they want to get him in to baptize a son because uh, the, um, the aristocrat is going to hit, um, marry him off to this American heiress named Lucy and um, she learns about this story, this background story of um, their family, and not her family but of the, her husband to be and um, it's it like I can't really, I don't want to get in, go into detail about it but like uh, basically it's a very uh, bestiality like in this and um, it's more of like a fetish type of movie like as uh, Valerium's movies usually are um, this it's very uh, art it's a very artsy film again like like Immoral Tales it's not for everybody but again they're all like, shot um, very well. Uh, um, the cinematography is great. There is obviously for the French uh, speaking you have to uh, read captions but the um, American ones you don't and which you know is great. Unless you don't know American then you'll have to watch subtitles for that. But, um, there, but when she finds out about this whole thing that happened about this ancestor of theirs with uh, bestiality it, it involves it like this big dream sequence where um, it's supposed to be one of the most outrageous dream sequences in the world and the trailer for this um, it's I'll be honest it's not the best trailer it really wouldn't if you had no idea about this movie really wouldn't make you go out and want to watch the, watch the movie because at least the what the trailer I saw it was just I believe it was just the dream sequence with this beast um, it's there's also another name for this uh, it's it's like a la bis b or whatever uh, it's another it's you know in French but um, it it's very wild again not for everybody uh, very uh, touching at times with uh, especially the times like this it's definitely something that you would never see in your theater around here um, it's kind of like a um, very taboo kind of a movie like a very no-no band you know in places and but it was like a big hit in France yeah in France it's La Bete I don't I'm sure I'm probably saying that wrong but maybe I'm not but it's you know La Bete um mean the beast which was like I said in my other review for Immoral Tales the, uh, the beast in there on that blu-ray version uh that was inspired and they made a whole movie of it and it's done really well. A lot of really cool shots to this movie. The Blu-ray looks awesome. Uh, on here, the special edition, um, there's the uncut 98 version of it. There's uh, optional English title, subtitles. Uh, see, so if you don't 
know uh, what they're saying in American. Uh, there's the making of it. There's French of Ecstasy, which is a visual essay of the evolution of Barozic's Beast and the Sequence that Never Was, Motherhood. So there's a, something very interesting for people if you're a really big fan of this movie. Um, there's a documentaries on here. There's trailers. There's commentary. Lots of good stuff. And I know the director is uh, has passed away, so you don't get his intro in here or anything. But uh, there is an, another intro to the beginning of this movie, and uh, it's just put together very well. Um, you know, I'm, the only thing I'm not really crazy about is the covers for you know the Beast and Immortal Tales, like the covers of these. Blu-rays, they're nothing extravagant, not really eye-catching, but being what the movie is, I don't know what you could really make the, the cover. <laughs> it's, it's uh, again, very controversy, uh, and you definitely cannot watch, this is not for children, uh, it's not for, uh, it's, it's not rated, but it's definitely not rated R, it's definitely not for everybody. And, uh, again, not my cup of tea, but I can respect it enough, it's, it's a, it's a, true art form you know and uh um it's it's really nice it's a it's a really good looking movie and uh, a wild story so uh again if this sounds like something you're interested in check out the link below the trailer will be below uh head on over to arrow films and get yourself a copy uh this is out now and uh also please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and uh spread the word of mr tony the dead so uh, that's it, everybody. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Bye.